Hello students, so today we are going to learn how to write missing words in sentences. So we are going to read the sentences and look at the picture beside it and then write the word here. Before we begin reading the sentences, I'm going to tell you the names of all the pictures, okay? Then later we are going to read the sentence and we write the missing word right there. Now, when reading a sentence, remember I told you a sentence begins with a capital letter and ends with a full stop. Begins with a capital letter, ends with a full stop. Capital letter, full stop. Capital letter, full stop. And after each word, there is a space. After each word, there is a space. So that is how we write a sentence. We don't just join everything together like one word. No, it's a sentence, so each word has a space. After a word, there is a space. And when you finish writing your sentence, you put a full stop at the end. So first of all, I'll tell you the names of all the pictures, then we can dive in to read the sentences, okay? I'm going to do the first two for you. This is a bat. It's a bat. Bat. Remember we use a bat? For baseball, bat and a ball. Sun, net, ten. And remember, if you pronounce the word or the picture correctly, you're going to write it correctly. If you don't pronounce correctly, you will not write it correctly. So we have bat, sun, net, ten. Now let's go into reading the sentences and writing the missing words. Let's go. Remember when reading a sentence, take note of the tricky words. You know, the tricky words are words that we have to memorize them to be able to read and write them. We cannot say the sounds. So, it's a tricky word. I. We all remember the tricky word I, right? I can, can, e, c, a. What is this? A bat. So, let's go. I can see a bat. Now, can you give me the sounds in bat? B, a, t, bat. So I'm going to write here bat. B, a, t. Very good. Now let's read the sentence. I can see a bat. Very good. Can you see a bat? Yes, this is a bat. So let's go to the next sentence. This is a sun. Sun. Very good. Now let's read the, sen the, the sentence. In this sentence, we have two tricky words. I and the. So remember, you will not blend them when reading. I can see the. What is this? Sun. Very good. Give me the sounds in sun. S uh, mm. Always say the sounds on your fingers before writing it. Okay? So let's write the sounds in sun. Let's say the sound. Go. S uh, mm. Sun. Very good. Now let's read the sentence. I can see the sun. Good job. Can you see the sun? Yes. Okay, the next picture we have is the net. Net. Very good. I can see a net. Give me the sounds in net. Net. So let's write it down. Net. So let's read the sentence. I can see a net. Very good. Can you see a net? Yes. Good job. Now the next one is 10. The number 10. Now let's read. I can see a 10. Now give me the sounds in 10. T -e -n. Now let's write. T -e -n. Now let's read the sentence. I can see a 10. Can you see a 10? Yay! Good 
job. So this is how we read sentences and write the missing words, okay? Thank you.